Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Welcome to today's video. We're gonna be talking all about one and done eyeshadows. I love one and done eyeshadows. I am a mom of two. I need something that is easy on the go and something I can just like slap on my lids and it looks pretty. Looks like I put some effort in, but really it took like five seconds to do. So if you guys like unfiltered makeup opinions and honest reviews, Subscribe and let's get into this video. We're going to be starting out with drugstore eyeshadows first and then we'll move up to more of a like high-end price point. I don't have a lot of like high-end price points. A lot of these are actually more on the drugstore side or they're independently owned brands of one and done shadows. Like singles that are just so pretty. And I wanted to start out with the lowest price pointed single shadow that I absolutely just mm, it's like chef's kiss so beautiful and it is the ColourPop Super Shock Shadow Formula. I have a couple of different shades. I have Micellum and Birthday Wish and Micellum although it is a like limited edition shade however I was able to find on the ColourPop site, there is something really, really similar to this shade. I believe it is the shade Ritz that's really similar. What I love about this is it is a great eyeshadow topper. It gives you like an iridescent look and it's also very like warm leaning. So it does give like a very warm, like iridescent sparkle on your eye. And it's beautiful during the summer, especially when you're just looking for something to like coat your lid and be on your way. And Ritz is really, really similar to Micellum. The Super Shock Shadows retail for $7 a piece. And there are so many on the ColourPop website that you can purchase from. Another favorite of mine is called Birthday Wish. This is like a duochrome. It shifts from like a white iridescent base to a purple. And it's so pretty on the eyes as well. Again, one of those like Really simple, one and done. If you're just looking for a little like sparkle on your lid, it's very translucent. It's absolutely gorgeous. And they do have like similar shades to Birthday Wish up on their site, on ColourPop's site. Those retail for $7. Like those are amazing. An oldie, but a goodie. And I can't believe I'm still able to find some of these because I thought they were like discontinued and they did actually have like more shades of these. They had a lot more shades of these singles and they have recently limited it to three and I was really really disappointed in the fact that like they got rid of a lot of them and I guess the whole like one and done singles era is you know it's kind of it used to be a really big thing when I was in high school. I used to buy these all the time in college and you know they kind of fell off the map and I thought that they weren't being manufactured anymore and they were. I was so excited and these are the Maybelline color tattoo 24 hour eyeshadows the first one that I have is social light and this is almost like a beautiful rose gold true rose gold color so beautiful across the lid you can use your finger or you can use a brush and I, I do recommend using a brush if you want more just a wash of color and it does help distribute the product more evenly on your skin it doesn't crease it doesn't clump on your eye but if you use a brush, it actually helps with the application and gets it to distribute more evenly on your eye. And then the other one I have is High Roller. And this is like a bronzy shade, very, very dark. And sometimes what I do is I take Social Light and I put it across the entire lid. And I will take this one and I use it as like a winged liner or I'll use it just in the outer corner here just to give my eye just a little bit of definition. But this is also a shade that I love to smear across my eye and it can be very opaque. Like this is such an opaque formula. They're very pigmented. A little goes a long way with these and they're just, they're absolutely stunning. They retail for $8. You can find them at Walmart and they are just so beautiful. Okay, let's talk about what is on my eyes today. And I have a independently owned brand and it's actually a part of a whole collection, but you can actually buy these shades individually. And they're some of my favorite one and done shades. It is the Nude Collection from Chaos Makeup. And I have the whole Nude Collection, but there's two shades that are just like absolutely beautiful as one and done. 
My first favorite is strawberry champagne. That's been all over my lid today. And it's a very, like, weightless looking shadow. That's the only way I can describe it. And it's very neutral. It does have a little bit of a pink tinge to it, hence why it's called strawberry champagne. But this is just such a beautiful shadow. They retail for $8. You can buy this shade for $8. You can use it on top of, you know, I actually ended up using another shadow that we will mention, but I used a cream shadow and then I laid this down on top. So if you want it to be a little bit more like I just used a wash of color and wash it off, but it can build up and be a lot more stunning and like opaque on your eye. It's just so pretty. And I love this one when I am looking for a little bit of like dressing up my eyes a little, but it's not like too over the top. And then also from that same collection and at the same price point, the other shade that I wanted to mention is called Topless, opaque foily buttery formula both of these are and I love this one especially just smeared all over my eye either with or without a base you can use it with and it's just so absolutely gorgeous like on the eye as a one and done and you literally just can't go wrong with this shade it is so beautiful I actually feel like it's a and I have a video on my channel of it being a dupe for one of the Charlotte Tilbury like pop shots and it it really is really similar to that shade. It is so pretty. It has like a taupe base to it, but it's a little bit warm too. So it does bring a little bit of warmth like back into your eyes. Both of those shadows are from Chaos Makeup. They retail for $8 and they are so stunning. I have here, this is a Burt's Bees Cream Shadow. This is the Color Nurture Cream Eyeshadow in Rose Cream. And this is such a beautiful moussey formula and it's very it's not foily like the Maybelline one it is more like wash of color across your lid I do recommend using like a flat brush to apply it with and it is just so stunning it doesn't crease on your eye at all at least it doesn't crease on my eye I have really dry eyelids though so if you have an oilier eyelid this is more of like a moussey formula so it may not do well if you have like really creasy eyelids and if you tend to crease with your eyeshadow this may not be a great one and done for you but if you have like dry lids like me this is so beautiful because it just makes them look glowy and I actually use this a lot in the cold girl makeup trend when that whole thing was going on this past winter because it is just that like perfect wash of color where it's like not translucent, but it's not completely foily opaque. It's like that medium wash of color across your eye. And it is just so long lasting because it's a cream shadow and it does dry down more to a powder formula. But they retail for $10 and they're just, this shade is just so pretty. I absolutely love it. I actually was wearing this every single day for a really, really long time. And I would either wear it with like a really beautiful crease shade and then the Burt's Bees, or sometimes I would actually wear it as like more of an eyeshadow base if I wanted that shimmer in there. And then if I wanted to pack a punch with like a really foiled shade or like a duochrome shade that was like more on that lighter shifty side of a duochrome shade, I would use this. And it just really made my eyeshadow like pack a punch. So it's just so beautiful. It's like, this is, this is my favorite one and done, I think, out of all of them. And the Maybelline is like a close second because I, I just love them. They're so affordable. I am not a fan of liquid shadows, but this one is actually not terrible. It, and I say that and I'm like, oh, this is the best one and done. This one is really nice. This is a Ulta Beauty Matte Cream Eyeshadow. So this is a matte formula. If you're looking for that matte base, it has a doe foot applicator, but it's like triangle, almost like pointy, but it's a very soft puff when you put it on your eye. I actually didn't even feel it go on today. And I did use this today as like more of my eyeshadow base. The shade that I have is called Game Over. And this is a very neutral skin tone shade. And I used actually a Singe Beauty brush, the EO5, to just blend the edges because this is such a tapered, tiny, small brush. I was able to blend the edges really, really nicely of this cream shadow. And it blended so effortlessly. It didn't cake on the brush either, which is really, really hard. Like 
a lot of times liquid shadows, if you blend with a brush, sometimes they like cake on the brush and this didn't do that at all. It's such like a, almost like a moussey texture. Very easy to blend out. I love this shade. It matches my skin tone really well. So it did create like a really great neutral base. And if you're looking for a liquid matte shadow, I definitely love this one. It retails for $10 at Ulta. Um, just keep in mind that with liquids, they're more prone to expiring sooner because you're constantly opening and closing it and, you know, you're introducing bacteria into it. So if you are looking for a liquid shadow, just keep that in mind. So let's talk about high end. These are like, they're not luxury. They're definitely more on the high end price point. There was a lot of drugstores, like go figure. But there are some really great high-end ones as well. And the first one, I was actually on the site today for Pat McGrath Labs. And Pat McGrath has some beautiful, like, eyeshadow singles. This is the shade Rose Venus. But a lot of the other shades are on Pat's site right now. And they're $12.50. They come in this little package right here. Rose Venus is a true rose gold. But it's more on the darker leaning side of a rose gold shade, whereas like some of these other shades, like the Maybelline one, this one's definitely on the lighter side of a rose gold. This is a darker rose gold, very foiled formula, very pigmented, very opaque, and it retails for $12.50 right now on the Pat site. And I will try and leave that linked down below for you. I did notice that a lot of those shades were like actually out of stock and I don't know if they're discontinuing these or not, but I did get this in a boxy term and I absolutely love this as a one and done and there are some there are some shades left. It's beautiful. Now, more on the like higher price point end of things and these are actually technically eyeshadow duos and trios, but they're just they're so beautiful. I had to also include them because they're like some of my favorite like one and dones or even two and dones. You can create very easy simple looks and that's the whole point of one and done shadows is like slapping it on your lid and going. And the first one I have is the Wander Beauty Double Date Eyeshadow Duo. It comes with a cream and a powder. The cream is called Swoon and I love this one because it's very like taupey and it's actually it's really similar to High Roller from Maybelline but it's very like this is one of those where I love to layer the two shades in here where I put the cream shadow on first and then as an eyeshadow topper I put on the powder product. This one is in the shade for the powder is smitten and it's just a very light wash of color on your eyelid and it's just it's so beautiful. So I love the the Wander Beauty double date duos. These are $26. They are very travel friendly and they come with this cute little mirror and that's one of the reasons why I love them. I received this in a boxy charm, but I, I started using it and I like fell in love with it. I used this a lot for cold makeup as well. Okay, so here's another like high end one. I don't I don't have any luxury ones. For another high end, this is actually a bento box like trio and it is the Kaya, the Kaja. It's the Kaja the Beauty Bento in Orange Blossom. I actually purchased this one during Sephora's like sale at the end of 2022 and they had a gift set of like a couple of Kaja things. That's when I picked this up. It retails for $26. It comes with three foil shades. So you have this brown shade here. You have this like orangey glittery shade and then the top shade is a really beautiful like orangey champagne like eyeshadow topper and all three of these are just so stunning as one and done shades I especially like out of all of them this is my favorite one the top shade I just use this as an eyeshadow topper it's very translucent it looks very like ethereal and it just is so beautiful on my eyes I would say that that is probably like my favorite in the little bento boxes but one thing I love about this is that it's very compact so it's very easy to travel with. $26 for three shades which is really good. If you do the math it makes them about $8.70 per shade which that's actually a really good price for like a single shadow. You know like the 
the chaos makeup ones those are eight dollars a piece so these are a little bit more but they're still a great price point and they the kaja eye stacks are just so beautiful they have a, a ton of variety and shades some of them come with matte formulas some of them come with like all shimmer formulas this one is an all shimmer formula but like I said, the one that I tend to reach for the most is that top shade. And it's just so pretty as a one and done shade. And then you obviously get the rest with them as well. So, there you have it. All of my one and done favorite eyeshadows. These are ones that you can just, you know, smear across your lid, head out the door, wherever you're going. And you, your makeup just looks so beautiful and put together. I absolutely love every single one of these. I use a lot of them all the time. And... <laughs> especially like when I'm on the go or even when I'm traveling. I love just having some one and done shadows where I know I can glam it up or I can, you know, kind of dull, dull it down a little bit and it looks more like every day. I hope you guys like this video. If you guys want to see more, leave me a comment down below and I hope you subscribe. So I'll see you again. Bye.